life in the water. I'm living life in the water. I'm living life in the water. I'm living life in the water. Water, water, water. On the scene is the musicians, everyone. Quiet on the set. Cute talent. Cameras rolling. In three, two, one. Welcome to the Hollywood Summit Show. Hi, I'm Morgan Monroe. I'm here with one of People Magazine's 50 Most Beautiful People in the World of 1998, Bai Ling. Hi, Bai. Oh, how are you? I'm good, how are you? I, I want to start this interview out by saying you're in amazing shape. Uh, what do you eat and how do you work out to keep yourself looking so beautiful? Okay, I, um, hmm. I, I actually sleep a lot and eat a lot of cheesecake and, and hot burning apple tart with vanilla ice cream and no exercise. So that's my therapy. I think it's, uh, it's basically your body. It's a whole universe mm -hmm. for you to spend and use to run. You're, you're, you're the runner. But I think it's to think healthy. And think healthy. Think beautiful. Then you'll be beautiful. I think that's where it should start. When you think that way, you'll automatically be beautiful. Like me. Your mother was an actress and a dancer, and your father was a music teacher. Uh, did your parents give you any hidden talents that the rest of the world don't know about? Yes, I am making an album with my crazy boyfriend. And uh, I'm writing a book. Probably eventually I'll get into producing film and direct film. And doing some blood film like God left, maybe. No, I, I, I think I'm, I'm... In nature, I'm just a gifted, multi-talented. Mm, in nature, just I have this gift. And it's for me to give, not for me to keep. I'm lucky to be here. I'm, I'm saying this because I feel everybody's talented, everybody's star, everybody um, potentially have the unique quality to be the superstar in whatever the best they're doing. So uh, I'm excited for life, but I don't, I don't like to think or set goals or know what I'm doing. I just feel like how I feel excited and you're confident of something. That means you have time. Your name in English means white spirit. Uh, who named you and what they have in mind with that name? White spirit, I think, is a free spirit. Of course, my parents named me because my, my mother actually teaches literature. My father teaches, they're all professors. My father is a professor of uh, music. I think music and literature, nature and poet, it's, it's formatted my soul. So white spirit is like, it's literally, I feel like I'm, I'm sometimes not existing. I think I'm like fire, air, and wind. And, and when, when nature needs me as a tool, so I appeared to be a sexy symbol or, or whatever I'm playing. I feel like um, this name, I don't know, in Chinese characters, is very simple and very unique name for girl. By means white means spirit, but the in written and white is the simplest character in Chinese. It's purity and innocence and, and white. But Ling in a complicated Chinese writing is it's a like a, a storm and three witches making soup like Macbeth. So the universe and the soul world and spirit world is complicated. So that's another part of me and provide me all this spiritual food to portray all kinds of characters. So I got lucky, but you have to have an innocent heart to have that true emotion to serve your character. You're in five to seven films in production right now, maybe eight that I know of. Uh, how do you find time for a life, and um, what do you do in your spare time? I think time find me. I think we are busy, you have more time, because when I'm not working, everything comes slow motion, I get up. I wake up. Is there a phone ring? I, everything comes so slow, so the day actually becomes shorter. When you're busy, you get up like five or four o'clock. Like right now, I'm shooting with Love Ranch with Taylor Hackford, great cast, Joe Pesci, Helen Mural. So we get up like every day, like four thirty, running in the snow. I'm wearing bikini and because it's a story about Bothell, first like a Mustang Ranch, Love Ranch in America. So. I have nothing to do with it, but I'm playing with the highest earner. 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 So I'm running around in Peking in the snow, you get up so early, and the whole day after shooting, still don't go out. It's just, I think, 
what you do something you love to do and give you energy, give you time. So I think the work contribute your talent is the best food for your health mentally and, and physically and for your heart too. To give something. Everybody wants us to talk about the gauntlet. Uh, when I think back, all I remember is the chaotic China, so many people and so hot it was in summertime. And for me it's just like I see all these flies, bees, and smell me because I'm full covered with blood. And I feel kind of after a while it's kind of sexy, you know, all blooded. And it's kind of make you kind of you want to be naughty. You feel like you're you're you want to make love. You want you want to do things that are, are are forbidden. I don't know that blood just make me feel like secretively just excites me. I think it's like kind of uh, of course the blood is sweet you can eat or using. It's somehow because psychologically it gets twisted because it's blood is real blood in the character, but actually it's not real blood. You can get away of putting the blood on and enjoy it and also think of the real blood. Psychologically, so I was totally twisted. Also by my character, I was like, wow, the secret world is kind of cool. Like all this dark places, and we have this set, it's beautiful in China. And it's nothing to do with China, but we're a man in China, back in time, back in space, and confused. And all the characters trip somewhere, but they're yet, they sort of have to making friends, but they eventually against each other, or they don't know about each other. I love my character, probably that's why we're, we're going to continue to shoot something that originally the director has in mind for some cop stuff for me on the street, just doing some fantastic flip around thing, like very hard, like shh. How do you feel about the way Yippie.com and the Gauntlet has set up the international online style of auditioning um, for film. I think it's so cool because it makes life so much easier for the director, casting director, gave so many choices and also for the fans, for the actors who have this dream. For example, if I live in some small town, I want to be a superstar and I have this dream, then I have submit my tape, maybe somebody will see me. I think it's open another whole world. I think it's very smart and it's fun and, and, and make people somehow participate in the film process. And when the film finally come out, and people already feel like they're part of it, and they will love so much more. I think it's such, such fun stuff. And I, 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 I want to see. I heard a lot of fans already become member, and they send their tapes. I hope there, there's one secret I have to tell you. If you're auditioning, put you on tape. You have to put some blood on your body, and somehow you have to transcend. Use some special technique, maybe develop some, and 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 transcend that scent to the director. So if you smell. If he smell, not smile, he will smile when he smell the blood. So that's something I think is important. But don't try so hard. So you have to, according to how you feel, it's right. Because if you exaggerate, you might turn yourself into behind the door. So you want to get in the front. I would like to thank you so very much for this interview and your time by. Good night and, and good luck to you this year. Thank you. On the scene is a mean team, down with their thing, pursuing a dream, grind, hustling, they trying to get green, they plotting this scheme, trying to bring things that will ring the bells of the people so that they can't remember the name, riding the waves of life instead they trying to be clean, keeping their fresh aboard in all of the devilish schemes, and all of the haters, and all of the fakers, nobody can break them, nobody can shake them, heartbreak is what really makes them, with the heart of a lion, soul of a beast, they never giving up, and they're ready to peace, I was up on the feet, niggas riding to the beat, coming up a new feast, do it all for the beat, they got what it takes to take the cake So the shake and bake and no time to take But I don't say gotta be strong Hey niggas I retired every day It's a long day